the internet is toxic as hell. Like, I, let's just, mm -hmm. it, it, because what happens is that the toxicity rises to the top because crazy people are much more interesting than sane normal people. Um, I think that the one of the biggest mistakes you can make in dating is, is to get dating advice from people on the internet. Um, I, I really think that is a trend that is just uh, horrifically unhealthy and toxic and uh, will lead you into a, an absolute abyss. It will make your life as miserable as the lives of the people that you're listening to. Um, and I only say this because I have insights into a lot of these internet influencers. I've created some, I've helped some people get their names out there and stuff. And, and I, and I just would sometimes find myself just stunned that I'd be thinking people are taking advice from you. You, your life, I know your life, your life is a complete mess. And, uh, and, and I'm just telling you, you know, y'all got to listen to smart people. You know, you got experts out here in your community. We just had the all black national convention, what nothing but experts there. What nothing but really smart people who actually have good lives uh, that can really show you how to live in a healthy way. You're not going to get as much of a of a dopamine rush by listening to a person that gives you good advice as you are from a person who is a train wreck. And um, and so that's the the first thing I would say. Second of all, with this this list, um, people can do whatever they want, but this and they have the right to say what they're going to say. Uh, but the idea that someone can make a list that you should make into your own list, that's a big problem. I also remember you're not qualifying the people who are giving you this list. The, the men who made this list, where what what's their life like? 